Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Kim, a fairly average mum, and today I've got my weekly Poundland haul. So let's get cracking. Hiya, it feels like I've been away for ages, right? You probably haven't noticed me gone, but I've actually been off filming for two days because I had my COVID jab and I didn't feel 100%. I knew I wouldn't because I know the people that have had it and I sort of thought that their symptoms, if I'd got the same, I wouldn't feel like filming. So I put up a couple of videos days in advance. So I'm back and I'm super happy to be back. I feel like I'm pumped and ready to go now. And I feel invincible now I've had that. Obviously I'm not, you know, and I'll be carrying on doing everything I've been doing before in terms of social distancing, not seeing people and everything else until we're allowed to go out and take part in normal life. But um, I, I'm so pleased to have got it. I've got underlying health conditions. So yeah, so it's just nice to feel like I've, I've at least had my first jab. So anyway, that's enough rambling. I've got my pound land all. Honestly, I went this week and I was super happy. I'll show you one thing that I got that I have been waiting and waiting to get. I saw it on another ladies' all. And this week when I went, they had them in, so I'll show you. But I'll show you some other things first. I, I, some of this stuff's been sitting here for a couple of days. So I'm just making that excuse because the first thing I'm going to show you is these, right? <laughs> Which I have clearly eaten. Okay. There's, I think there's only one bag left in it, right? Oh, I love them though, right? They're just like rice cakes, snacker jacks, 91 calories in each one. I got them in chilli flavour, sweet chilli flavour. I absolutely love them. So I've already got through three of them. I've only got one left. Anyway, you know, it is what it is. So next up, I got a few books for the boys. Um, now, one of the boys is only one, but the other one's four. So I'm always on the lookout to get some books that I think are a bit more sort of older, you know, not just little board books and things. So I saw these. Well, my kids had this first one. What's the first one? Is the I Want My Potty. They're by Tony Ross. So I got the I Want My Potty one, which my kids will probably remember from them being little. And then there were a whole load of other ones, but I thought I won't get them all because I don't know whether they're going to like them, but I got this. I want to do it by myself, which I thought were cute. Um, I want my dad. I like that one. And I want my dinner. So, yeah. So, they're just like the lovely little pictures in them. Let me show you this one. So I just really liked them. And they were only a pound each. Look, they're so cute, the pictures in them. There's not a lot of text, but there's enough to keep a little one interested. Look at those. Just lovely, lovely, lovely pictures. So yet yeah, only a quid each. What's the recommended retail? Let me put my glasses on for goodness sake. Him. Right, the recommended retail price is six ninety nine in the UK. So, but here, I mean, for six ninety nine to get them for a quid is brilliant. I thought, yeah, little princess series, really nice. So I got those. Then I got this set of spoons. So, um, honestly, we go through spoons at a rate of not seeing this house. I think what happens is that the kids, when they're finished with summer, they leave them in a pot and it gets thrown out or, you know, they scrape food away and so the spoons go missing. So we're always short on them. So I thought I'd get a set of six spoons. They're all right. We've had them before. Yeah, they're really good, I think. I mean, they are only spoons, you know. They're not, they're not world changing or anything, but, you know, at least they'll keep us going a bit longer because there's no worse. When I go to get my pot of coffee, and I'm like, I've got a spoon either that big, which is the only one that's left in the drawer. Or we've got this one that's like bent. I don't even know what that's for. And I'm trying to like make a coffee with it. It's just a non-starter. I end up with coffee powder everywhere and all sorts. So yeah, so I'm really happy I got my spoons. Then I got some of these for my partner. He likes these pots of fruit on his porridge. Uh, peach and pear, these ones are in. But I, I mean, I don't like this. I like porridge to taste like syrup and coconut and things like that. But he really likes them. So I thought I'd try these out because he normally gets them from somewhere else. 
but I think they're more expensive than these. So I thought I'll get them, see if he likes them. You know, and if he does, I'll buy him some more. Then I got some more fruit winders. They didn't have the double ones this week because they normally the ones that I go for are the strawberry and apple ones because they're doubles. But I just could only get the strawberry ones. So there's five in a pack. Let's see what these are like now. I do like them because it's just squashed fruit. Oh yeah, I like that look. So it's just a, it's the same amount in them actually, but it's just strawberry in them like that. They're really tangy and lovely. I really like them. Then I seen this and I just loved it. Um, it says, love you, mum. But it's like, look at it. I went through loads of them just to find a one that had a cute face. Let me take that tag off, off it. I don't think it matters. Right. I went through loads of them to find one that had a cute face. And I like this one because it had a bong eye. You know, because one eye is like miles higher than other. So, yeah, it says, love you, mum, on it. And that's it, iridescent. It's my new word. So, yeah, I loved it. He's a, it's a bit odd on his back. It looks like he's got a bit of an hunchback. But I think bears are like that anyway, aren't they? So, yeah. Yeah, cute. I liked it. Then I seen they had these left. Now, I saw these over Valentine's Day. They're just glass hearts. I, but I'd never picked them up. And I regretted it, really. So, when I saw they'd got a few in, I thought, oh, yeah, I'm definitely going for them. Look, they just stand up. They've got a flat bottom bit so you can stand them up. But I just liked them because they're all like crackly on, on outside. So I got it in this greeny colour. And then I also got this yellow one. I just love all that sparkly and in a heart shape. So yeah, I got those. Really cute. Yeah. I'm just going to put them in my cabinet, you know, along with all my other nonsense that I get. So, yeah, that's them. Then I got this massive bag of popcorn. I mean, look at the size of it. Sweet and salted. I think I can eat this. I didn't check, but I usually can eat popcorn. I'll try to read it. Suitable for vegans, suitable for gluten-free diets. Excellent. So I can eat that. I might share it with other people. I might not. I might just scoff it all myself. <laughs> No, I won't do that. We'll share it with other people. But I just thought it were amazing. Look at size of it. It's like a carrier bag full. I don't know. Flippy flops. Yeah, you're not going to run out faster, that, are you? 300 grams. Then I got a load of bits for my daughter's cooking. Because like I've been saying on the other video, she loves cooking. and um, But she's she's a bit strapped for cash at the moment. So with the being on furlough. So I got her a few bits anyway. So I got this one. I got a few of these. So this one's got like jazzy ones in look like that. Really nice. I liked it. Party sprinkles. I got her some milk chocolate chips. Cool, how many is getting that? It's quite a big bag, I think. Uh, 140 grams. Wow, that's all right. And then I got other white chocolate chips as well. Same size bag. Really nice. Then I got these, which are edible wafer flowers. Look at them. Quite pretty. Thought they'd be nice on a cupcake or something. I'm sure she'll think it's something more exciting to do with them than I would. But anyway, I liked them. Then I got this writing icing. Now, I don't know how good this is going to be. When I've ever given these a go, I've made a right performance out of it. This one is just in green, black and white for that one. I think I got another one of them. Oh, yeah, I did. I got this one, which is in purple, pink and blue. I mean, they might be rubbish, but they might be nice, you know. And then I also bought these sprinkles, which are dinosaur sprinkles. Look at them. Jazzy. And then I also got these under the sea sprinkles, but look at those little fishy tails. They're just so pretty, aren't they? I love it that they have all, had an old range of them. So, yeah, so I got those. Then I bought myself some of these. I think I bought two packets of these because um, I'm running low. I always get these whenever I'm in because the raspberry and pomegranate, they're just a multivitamin, but I love them because they're chewy and they don't taste horrible. So, yeah, 
So I get one of those, I get a packet of those every time I'm in. They've got loads of different vitamins in. So yeah, but they're nice ones. Because I don't like the other ones, I choke on them, you know. Then I've seen these little hearts and I just liked them. I think the bath fizzes, heart fizzes, yeah. So they are, I got a white bag and a pink bag. I just thought they were cute. They're only little look, but I, you know, I just really liked them. How many did you get in each one? Is it six? Yeah, six in each bag. But I mean, six for, uh, for a pound, you know, that's not bad at all, is it? That's six baths worth for each one, you know, really nice. And like I say, I love out in an art shape. It's just really cute. So yeah, I got those. And then as I were going in, I seen these. So they had these in all different colours. Oh, mine started to, oh, that one's pulling apart, look. There, just pushing back up, they're all right. I got three of them. They were only a pound a bunch. Really nice. So they're just tulips. And like I said, you could get them in all different colours, but I really like the purple. I don't know what I'm gonna where I'm gonna put them because I don't really have purple in any room, but I did like them anyway. I thought they were too good an opportunity to miss. How many did you get on each bunch? Is it six? Six tulips on each bunch, and they've got like a little tie round bottom. And it just says tulip bouquet. So yeah, got three of those. Could have got different ones. Could have got one of each different one. But I just like the idea of a whole bunch of purple flowers for three quid. Nice. So yeah, they're nice. Like them. Then when I got to check out, I bought this little purse thing. Well, the woman thought I, it were mine. She said, is this yours? I didn't know what she meant at first. I said, yeah. Because I, I, I sort of, I thought at first she meant, is this supposed to be in here? And I was slightly embarrassed that she were asking me because I thought what she was saying was, you know, have you are you buying this? Is this something you've decided to buy? But what she were actually saying is, did it actually belong to me already? Which made me feel even more silly, really, because I think, you know, it clearly looked like I would be carrying this for myself. Whereas in actual fact, I bought it for a child. Um, but yeah, what she actually meant was well, she didn't recognise this as belonging to Poundland. So yeah, so it was just a bit confusing. So then having had that conversation and got myself all in a bit of a tizzy and a bit confused, when she asked me, did I want to buy any Turkish Delight, I had to say, yeah, <laughs> I don't even eat Turkish Delight. <laughs> I can't eat them and I don't know anybody that wants them. But I just felt so embarrassed and sort of all like... Um, confused that I ended up saying yeah yeah I'll buy some so I've got Turkish delight now that I didn't I don't want and I you know I'll have to find somebody that wants some water she could have literally at that point she could have asked me to buy anything and I would have said yeah do you want um this second hand car yes yeah I'll go, yeah oh yeah I'll go for that literally anything she could have asked me and I'd have bought so anyway I got Turkish delight could have been 100 times worse couldn't it Goodness knows what she could have asked me to buy. Anyway, shares in the company or something. I don't know. I seen this little glass and I bought my, other, my daughter one um, the other day that were from Home Bargains. And I just saw this one. I really liked it. I just liked it as a glass. Look, it was £3. It wasn't a pound. It's got a little coaster that says gin on it. But I just loved the glass. Just thought it was really nice. Yeah, it's all got lumpy bits around it. Can you see? It's like coggle day or whatever you call that there'll be a technical word i don't know it gin glass and coaster set yeah i liked it so i bought that really nice my last thing which is the thing that i was so happy that i had in were these look oh my days how cute are they they're like little like pearl pearlescent iridescent or whatever um little bunnies look i got it in blue and yellow i'm not finished i've got some more and i got it in pink and purple but i didn't just buy one set i bought two sets so i've got eight <laughs> because i just loved them and i've been waiting for weeks for them to come in i seen them on another lady's video she'd got them on her poundland one and I thought, I, I just didn't think they were ever going to come into my Poundland because my Poundland's quite small. So when I seen them this week, that it was just too much for me to like miss out on. So like I say, I bought 
I got two sets of four. So I've now got two pink, two purple, two yellow and two blue. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. <laughs> but I just love them. I'm going to put them in my cabinet. Because I honestly just love them. I did think if my kids wanted any as well, I could send my kids them. You know. But I, I don't know if this is their kind of thing. So it's definitely my kind of thing, you know. But yeah, I don't know if it's their kind of thing. But I couldn't not get him. Look at them all. I don't know which is my favourite. Look, there's a yellow one. And my blue one, look. There we go. Whole collection of them. Really nice. It made me so happy to see them. So, yeah. So that's everything from my Poundland haul. If you've liked this video, please give us a like. It really does help us out. And if you like this kind of content, you might want to consider subscribing. Thank you very much for taking a few moments out of your day to spend with me. Bye!